Could they really not tell that it was Superman when all he did was put on a pair of glasses? Reviews from the tub. Reviews from the tub. Gonna review shit from my tub. What's up, y'all? Welcome to the show. We're doing some clerical work today, so we got on our uh, I Look Smart and like a sexy secretary glasses. If that was sexist, I apologize. Because, you know what, not all secretaries can be sexy. And you know what, we need to accept that. But with that said, it's time for a nice afternoon cup of coffee. Now, every so often I would do a, a creamer review where I was driving to work and I would try a new creamer in my coffee and you would come along for the ride. I have not been going to work. I am injured. I am sitting at home on my ass. This is this fucking, fucking awesome. 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 Like, honestly, like, what, what do you want to be when you grow up? Unemployed. Because this is tremendous. And now I'm, I don't want to be a leech off the government. But yeah, hey, you know what? Why don't you guys click subscribe and like and all that shit now while I got you here in the first minute of the video. Um, creamer. We're drinking coffee creamer. We got today Unlocked. The new Unlocked line from, who the fuck made that? Coffee Mate. Hey. Uh, this here is a uh, classic Colombiano. Makes any cup taste like rich Colombian coffee. Now, I don't know what that means. I don't know what the difference is between coffees, where they're from, what a Colombian coffee tastes like versus a Peruvian coffee. I don't know. But we're going to put this in our own coffee here. And uh, we should tweet a celebrity. Who are famous Colombians? Pablo Escobar. Escobar, okay. Uh, I'm trying to think of... Uh, oh, Valderrama, the soccer player. He's Colombian? Carlos Valderrama. Oh, I'm thinking of the, the kid from that 70s show. <laughs> no, Fez? Yeah. What the hell's his name? I thought it was something Valderrama. I need ice. W Wilmer Valderrama. I, I don't know where he's from. Uh, excuse me, my wife's making a Delgona coffee. Not with... Can you give me a spoon, please, so I may stir this? Uh... Is Sofia Vergara? That's that's who, kind of who I was thinking of, but I don't know offhand. I said I was doing clerical work. I legit have my computer open. Hang on. How do you make the internet be a thing? Um. Oh, we're already on the internet. Sofia Vergara. Is a Colombian American actress. There you go. Works for me. No. I know. Don't do that. No. You're gonna die. Arroba Sofía Vergara, ¿quieres estar en el creciente programa de YouTube en ayunas? Subí tres suscriptores esta semana. Podemos hablar de bocadillos Colombia y bocadillos en Colombia. I think she's gonna be on the show. Um, you know what we should? Next, next episode of the show, we'll tweet her fucking husband too. You ever see that fucking hunk of man? Yeah. Good lord. Well, I haven't seen right, he was the man. wolf on True True Blood. Uh, I don't know, he was in uh, oh, Magic he, Mike. He was in Magic Mike with Kevin Nash and Olivia Munn. Channing Tatum. And Channing Tatum. A one? spoon, please, so that I may yeah, do. Give it to you. Oh, I put it in there. Oh, jeez, I'm so tired, y'all. My sleep schedule is butt fucked to death. Cool bullshit, you're unemployed. I, yo, the top to my thing? I got two fucking. What am I doing? Get it together, big guy. Like, this isn't a work, man. I, I, did I put one in here and stir it and then ask for another spoon? That would be like that. Oh, this is the way to go for these. Believe me. Oh, I don't know what's happening over there. Um, uh, can you the take room. these from me? Your wife slash producer. Start fucking producing. I like my own cup of coffee. Well, my all right. My review of toasted marshmallow mocha is delightful. From Coffee Made as well. Oh, also, I think there was more in the Unlocked. All right, Sofia Vergara. We're going to find a new tab because we got Coffee Mate Unlocked. Yo, you look look how fast I type, bro. I'm, I'm in the line, wrong line of work. I'm going to leave warehousing and become an administrative assistant. All right. I can't see that. Oh, Italian Espresso Roast. So we went with classic Colombian instead of Italian espresso roast. Uh, I don't know why. It's probably the only one they had. Or 
I like Colombian coffee. We like Colombian coffee. Nice. We could have got them both, but how much fucking creamer do we need? I, you know what I should do? Um, as far as this review goes. Oh, it's so good. I sh what do you? Oh, you, all right. Can I see that? Look at this. Y'all ever have a Delgona coffee? It's like a, you know what? You gotta do it in a container with a top so you can. So you, so can, you can judge shake instead of the shake. In. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what though? I think we did one of these on that channel, like at the beginning of quarantine. So we're gonna find that and throw a link at the end of this video. But anyway, what I was saying. Welcome to the fucking reviews. Rambles from the tub at the kitchen table in front of the nice scenic. If I'm gonna review this coffee, I should drink it. Is what I was getting. To. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Thank you guys so much for coming back time and time again. It smells like coffee. <laughs> it smells like coffee. It tastes. All right, that's good. And now it says here, bright fruity notes. I don't know what that means, but it definitely makes the, that Keurig coffee taste better. I think that's better than just a, I might've put, I usually do my customary two teaspoons of sugar and I still did that. And usually I cut back when I do a creamer cause it's too fucking sweet. Oh, I taste the sugar. Yeah, I made it too sweet, but. Is that sweetened? I don't know, but it's got fruity notes. It's gotta be sweet. Total sugars, five grams. Now I'm curious to see like what's right. normal. So five grams of sugar in a classic Colombian unlocked coffee mate. Versus, which is normal to all which the is other normal creamers for other too. creamers. So it's just okay. sweet. So I just shouldn't have put in so much sugar. I like this though. It adds it adds a, a depth and a robustness to your regular Keurig coffee. You have no freaking idea what you just No, said. that actually sounded pretty fucking good. I know it sounded good, but do you know what it means? Listen. <laughs> Sofia Vergara and what's his husband's name? Something Maldonado? No, it is an M though. This is I like having the Google machine. Uh Sofia Vergara. Uh, husband comes right up. Because bitches be Googling him. No, I didn't mean that either. Manganinello. Hey. Yes. Oh. We should see if they want to come over for dinner. Okay. Um um, I see here that she used to be married to Joe Gonzalez. What a dumbass. What a dick, Joe. What are we rating this? Did you try you tried it? You said it was too sweet. I can't taste it. You can't you can't taste the robustness and the dark characteristics. Well, I, the sugar. I don't put sugar in my coffee normally. <laughs> High five, y'all. Why are you such a hater? Hater's gonna hate. Uh, also, I just farted and it smells terrible. I think that's it. Did I did I describe the robustness and the dark flavor enough? Well, it not dark, it's stronger. It tastes more coffee-y. So if you have cheap coffee, get this. Flavor enhancement. Yeah. I want to give this an eight. I'm fucking enjoying this. This is a good right. cup of coffee. Well, don't forget to use it so it doesn't sit in the fridge for three months. I'm so bad at that. I just, I didn't know it was possible, but I just threw out a creamer. It had gone chunky. And I didn't know that was possible because home there's style. no milk in it. The home style. When it's Whoa. chunky. It was cocky. <laughs> All right, guys. <clears throat> Excuse me. Be sure to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and Twitch. Uh... At Reviews from the Tub, I'm having fun on TikTok, but I think I'm going to delete that app. That's a cesspool. I was watching some guy wrestle his dog, but he doesn't know how to work right, and I think he was hurting the dog, and I commented, like, yo, man, fucking stop. And then people are, like, laughing at it, like, oh, it's just a dog. Yeah, it's just a fucking dog, and dogs are awesome, and they're better than this fucking jabroke. He was, like, really wrestling? I, like, he was like, doing, like, you wrestle with George? No, no, me and George go at Me and George have vicious battles, but, like, I know how to work. Like, I, I, I sell maneuvers. This guy was he like, wasn't hurting the dog. I don't. Right? He looked like he wasn't trying to, but he wasn't also trying to not hurt the dog. He was doing like wrestling finishing moves on the dog and like doing like straight down on their fucking heads. I'm like, yo, know, man, like, yeah, you might have that under control, but you're a bell end. Go feed it. I reported it to TikTok and they're like, oh, well, it doesn't violate any of the community guidelines. So that's kind of where I was like, well, fuck you, TikTok. Fuck you. Fuck you and your stupid app with this, <laughs> this fucking hot chick dancing. <laughs> you, you sent me two TikToks. I know. When, it, when, it, when you find a good TikTok, it's comedy gold. And when you, then the rest is just fucking trash and fucking idiots who think they have something important to say. If you want something important said, get a YouTube channel. Right. Like reviews from the top. <laughs> All right. I have successfully dragged this past the 10 minute mark. 
Uh, did I say to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, maybe TikTok and Twitch at Reviews from the Tom? Uh, be sure to click this little subscribe gimmick. Let's see, we're going to do this. Subscribe right here. Hey. Uh, I did a mukbang. Hey. And here's a playlist of me eating. What playlist should we use? Chips. Chips. Hey. Hurry, there's a puppy outside. There's a puppy outside? Hurry, hurry, moving.